Yes, Q12 is here, and we're going to be playing some Esper Control, Drago, my paper list. This is a one-to-one -one, one -to -one recreation of the paper list I have in real life, so let's just get this thing in the game and see what it does. Violin, a creature. That's a pretty good name. We will win the die roll, of course, and we'll keep this hand. Serum Vision's turn one is pretty good. We have to shock ourselves. Fetch and shock to do it. Actually, we can just shock here. I like that they're better. Visions putting waste on the bottom, snare on top, passing the turn. Take a stop off the upkeep. Let's see what our opponent is on. Hopefully not something any. Hopefully not something nasty. It's looking like ad nauseum. Thought sees taking away one of our logic knots or desper charm. If they take away the Blessed Alliance, then it might be a some kind of creature deck, but I doubt it. Take away Esper Charm. Sounds pretty good. If it's Ad Nauseum, Esper Charm's for the that one enchantment that they roll. Let's see. Delta, past turn. Does not know of the spell center on top or the spell center in our hand. See if he slams in a turn two play or another disruption spell, which will just log not here. Fetches. I think our opponent's on Esper as well. What kind of mid range strategy here? Just go ho. Go ahead and log not this. For two, ditching this, visions. Our opponent has a spell pierce. They're more than welcome to use it, or a main deck disc, but that'd be some nasty stuff I'd see. Visions, pretty good. No turn two play. We should have got a black source, but oh well. We don't have any uses for black yet. Play the island past turn, or play the ghost court, I mean, past, past turn. Our opponent in the tank for his turn 3 play. And he is on Esper here. Let's see what he does here. He's gonna take this. Oh, that's a nasty. Let's see. Hmm. I think we might as well walk not this, even though it's. Really bad on us. Take it out of our hand. The Lingering Souls is pretty good. Now next turn he'll try to play it. He can't spell snare that, sadly, for his flashback. We have Supreme Verdict, which is very nice. No land, so we have to pass turn. Our opponent will... See, what would he do? Just flash souls and pass turn. Sounds pretty good. Yep. We'll probably gain life with this. Take a few beats with souls. I really don't want to slam the Supreme Verdict just for two spirits at the moment. I want to play something big. See, hopefully our opponent plays Tassiger. That is beautiful. Beyond beauty. <laughs> Ooh, we do not have a fourth land. I forgot about that. We will untap. Draw our untapped source. Slam that Supreme Verdict past that turn. See what our opponent does. Serum Visions again. I did not note his uh previous Serum Vision. I'm pretty sure it was top top. I know he's doing bottom. Bottom bottom. Does not. Does not find what he needs. Here comes a disruption spell. Take our good old Blessed Alliance. Oh no, another Serum Visions. Let's see how he does this one. So I'm pretty sure he drew the serum off the other serum. Top, top, top. That sounds pretty good. Draw another land source. 
we don't have triple blue. Pretty nasty. Cryptic command would be pretty good here. We could cryptic our own planes for an island, but that's really bad. Is it worth? Hmm. I don't think it's worth. Not at the moment. Okay, here maybe. Blue, blue, white. Sacrifice goes quarter. Destroy planes. Give me a the third blue source. Yes, sir. Island. Counter draw. That's my only foil cryptic command. I hope you guys like it. We draw a fourth land source or a fourth land. Pretty good. Play that flooded strand. Tapped. Pass that turn. We can probably take two for a bit. I just want to fetch this and get it out of the way. I don't feel like taking two off the fetch to gain four off this blessed alliance on escalate two. That was a lot to take in, so basically I want to escalate two. Make him sacrifice attacking creature and gain four. We're at 15, he's at 14. He has two creatures on the board. Did not play whatever he was going to play. We have a... He does not have shadow. Play island, pass turn. I feel like he has a click here. Snapcaster will meet a snare. Hmm. Can I get the pressure out on me? I'd rather not path or use my removal yet. We can take six more turns of this. So I'm feeling pretty confident. We just need to get some card advantage cards out here. Pull out the other Tassiger. I'll be happily. I would happily path this boy. The Angler. For sure the Angler resolves. Play around this mana leak here. See what he does here. Remand. Nope. So I'm thinking it's mana leak here. He does two untap lands like that. Cryptic command. Uh. We'll pass turn. All right, we can take six more attacks from this, from these spirits. Mm. Wish I had another land source or another land. I mean, what is this? Sure. Counter target spell. Draw a card. Into our wrath. And have a second white source that is nasty. Ah, time to look for it. There it is. Ah, this is nasty, 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 nasty. Does he have a snare? Hmm, pass turn. I'll play into his mana leak here, it'll at least get it out of his hand. We'll gain four if it resolves, we'll gain four. Or lose three, actually. Or just gain one. We'll net one life. If we do this. Okay, escalate two. Four. That. I gain four. He sacrificed the attacking creature. There. I'll let the leak hit it. Black, blue. Counter squall. It's pretty nasty. Wait a minute. I can tap this better. There we go. Pass that turn. We're at a dangerously low four. That's two counter squads away from dying. Sorry about that train going off in the distance. Snapcaster Mage. And with Snapcaster's ability on the stack, path your boy. 
Unless he has Mana Leak for real this time, or another Counter Squall, then we're done. Nope. No Mana Leak, no Counter Squall, so the last two cards in his hand is probably removal, like Paths. For sure. Has nothing to do, pass his turn with three cards in hand. Play Colonnade, pass that turn. We're gonna sure fire off this Esper Charm here. Three cards that did nothing in the last two turns. That's... I'll draw two. Let's place around his leak if he has any. So I'm thinking he has removal. Or what is this? Squall? Yep. So removal, removal maybe. Does he have anything to finish me off here? If he has click, he has click. I'm, I need to get this thing toys out of the yard. Or get that Fluttershine out of the way too. Oof. We won't play our lands here. I want him to feel like he has counters to get through. Fetches. Watery Grave. For all we know, our opponent is probably doing the same thing we're doing. He's holding lands in hand. Alliance is pretty good. Gets us out of the red zone. Now what he's doing, he just has to look for his threats like Tassiger, Snapcast, the Angler, which is probably what he's coming, coming in right now. Is it the Angler? He tap, if he doesn't tap his white source, he has paths for sure. Yeah. Sure. Let's see. Ah. Well, we have the Blessed Alliance. He's gonna get one of his squalls back. Very nasty. Go to blocks. Escalate two modes. Gain four. Sacrifice a creature. There we go. We have a negate to do whatever. Okay. It resolves. Sacrifice Tassiger, please. You can get one of your counter squalls back. What? Hmm. Wonder why he needs to untap the mana for. Do not need these lands. I guess I could be playing them and thinning out the deck, but having a uh, four cards in hand against his three can do a lot in someone's mind. We're just playing mind games here. Shambling Vents, nasty. He's gonna activate our. Activate his removal spells with that. Uh, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, three, four, five. Let's play this Blood of Strand past that turn. I should have played the Polluted Delta. We can't fetch a basic with this. If he doesn't attack with this, that means he doesn't have the removal, but he will. Here. We have the negate for it. Coming in. Two, three, four, five. Activate the colonnade. Let's me block. Let's see. I'm pretty sure the path's coming in now. He wouldn't let me block. There's no reason to throw in the path or the negate. Because if he didn't let me block, then I would have wouldn't have been able to tap the Celestial Colonnade for mana. Oh, what is this? Second path? Yep, two paths in his hand. We will get out our basic swamp. So he does no damage here. That's a bad play on our opponent's side. Get this Flood of Strand. Get us a hollowed fountain. Pass the or take our turn. 
That's pretty nasty. Hmm. Let's see, do I think our opponent has a counter here? Which one of these? Let's see, one, two, three, four. I can do it for three. It's pretty good. I should do it for four. Your opponent is going to fire up the vent. It's two cards in hand that he had last turn. Let's see. One, two, three, four. Okay. Yeah. Four warriors. We'll block with all of them. One, two, three, four. In that case, like if he has removal, uh, our warriors aren't for nothing. All right, he's assigning blocks or damage. So we'll walk away with two warriors here, and we can start putting down a small clock on him. Now, spell center stays in. Counter spell is a pretty good card to counter. We'll fetch here. Got our last source of mana. Or fetchable mana. Back with all creatures. Pass the turn. I'm really scared of a click coming in. Because. Can't let him know we're having just two lands in hand for no reason. Alright, he has two cards in hand that hasn't done a thing yet. And I had... Secure the Waste. So he doesn't have any counters. I'm not really sure what he has. We can find out right now. Deck with all creatures. I play discards too. What do you have? I am very curious. Discards, flaying tendrils, slaughter pact, sorceries, instance. Okay, okay. Pretty good, pretty good. So if we uh, secured the waste for just three, he would have got us this pact, no problem. Angels is pretty cool. Uh, we'll just use it on here. I don't want to get down in the red zone. Only had a colonnade out, and if we stop drawing lands. That'd be pretty nice. Oops. What does he play here? Thought Scour himself. Yep. Yeah, there's his clicks. Is this Geist? I think. Think twice. Spell center does not hit him. Yep, you get the guy. Now we need to get our removal. Ugh. <laughs> One, here we got six. Is there a better way to do this? Comes in for four, not good. Hmm. Snap Blessed Alliance, but what if he draws counters? Uh, 
How many counter spells I see is this counter squall. I think we'll just have to do this. Just force through the safe plan. Supreme verdict here. We should have got in for damage, but oh well. Yeah, might as well. Get in for one. He has to block. What? What is he doing? Plays land passes. Okie dokie. Sphinx, pretty good. I'll fire it off on his upkeep here. Yep. Draw 8, gain 8. And that should be the game. Whew, these lands are coming in fast. <laughs> have nine cards left in the library. I'm gonna slam this waste fast. Okay, what does our opponent have? Good old snap. The good old collective brutality. Take our secure waste. Yup. He's gonna have to do it. So now we gotta go on the colonnade plan. Yep. One of these. One of these. Mm -hmm. We gotta charm him. Fetching, he's at 18, we're at 8. It's pretty good. Take these out of our hand. There you go. Okay. We won the first game. We put on our extractions. Counter spell sweet. We need attention sphere. He has souls. Uh, souls? Not really what I need at the moment. Time reinforcements, not what I need. Ruined Halo is pretty cool. Rest in peace is option. Disenchant? I don't think you can bring in anything like that. Condemn? Not pretty sure. So. For sure, we're taking out at least three commands. One logic knot. Uh, a sphinx. Can't take out two secures here. A sphinx and a... Probably the last logic knot here. Yeah, probably the last logic knot. And we'll go at him with... Where are my snapcasters at? Oh, here they are. We'll get him with these six cards, trying to get some dirty stuff out of his way. The rest, that should be the, the second thought sees. Um, do we need the rest in peace? Crypto Command's too big. Logic Knot on the draw is not good. Sphinx can get countered easily. Secure the way. I mean, Sphinx can get countered by a dispel, so I'm gonna try to get that dispelled real quick. Rest in peace. Ruined Halo naming Tassiger. Ruined Halo naming Tassiger is pretty good. Serum Visions on the draw. Ugh, it can help us find lands though. I want to cut like one Serum for one Ruined Halo. How should we do this? Just load up on removal. I would think loading up on removal. Yeah, take the Serum Visions out. Rune Halo can name. Click. It's pretty good. Oof. 
take out probably the last crypt they can leave in once they're in visions. Play it like that. My face has gotten orange. Let me try to fix that. Give me this controller. This hand we will keep. It's a pretty good Serum Visions. Let's see, let's try to get this white balance fixed. Serum Visions turn one is pretty good. Oh, that's as pretty. It's as good as I can get the white balance. Yep. My, the reason my face is orange is because my computer has the program Flux on it, and with Flux. It's like to reduce stress on your eyes. Basically, gunner optics as a software. Let's try and get these out. Hmm. Play one of those. Play one of these islands. Put this on top. Hmm. Yep, this on top. It's on the bottom. Pass that turn. You can go ahead and uh, destroy us or whatever. Distract us. Extract us. Thought seize us. Duress us. A pretty good hand to, do, to get the rest. Yep. Pick the dispel out. Throw it in the yard. Or... No, he would take a removal. Because he wants to play things. Linger Soul is pretty good. Takes my alliance. Pretty good. Fetch that. Get this. Shock that. Play this. Shock us again. Oof. Some nasty cards here. Let's see. We can't deal with the Geist. So we have to take that. Snap and Tendrils. Get the Lingering Souls out. Oh, I thought I was going to Spell Snare that thing. Can't Spell Snare the Flashback cost. Only the Converted Mana cost. Dang it. I wish. Gotcha. No more Tendrils. Didn't I scry that plane somewhere else? Well, I'm playing it. Should have played that Flood Strand, actually. He's seen my hand before. He has that good old snap. He needs to get this souls out in the open. I don't want a path because he's still running low on lands here. Yep. Extraction's pretty lit. What could I take out? Hmm. I can surgical whatever he tries to snap. That sounds like a good idea. Oh wow. Coming in two in the face. I think I'll path one guy. Doesn't seem pretty, but... Trying to get him to snap something. Take one here. We'll take two anyway, because we're going to fetch that boy. But let's get that snap out. Pithing needle. Let me f let me crack this Flutter Strand real quick. I'm not going to get needled at the moment. Calm down. He can go ahead and name whatever he wants. What? Colonnade? That's pretty good. A celestial colonnade. There it is. Yes. Fortress, yes. Pass that turn. He has snap in hand. He's going to snap. Mm -mm -mm. Snap catcher mage, yep. Targeting Serum Visions. It's a pretty good play. <sighs> Give me some removal. Brutality. He's going on that plan. 
Heck no, boy. Give me that brutality. Let me extract that thing. You can try to negate this, counterscore this. Please try. Thank you. Thank you. Zero cards in hand. Only one brutality? Two? What do you have? Anguish I'm making is pretty lit. Dispel, guys, the anglers, souls, murderous cut, all the paths, the pithing needles, all stern visions, pack, casters, snares. I'm gonna take a picture of this. This is too good to pass up. Take a picture of his whole library. Alright. One click, okay, okay. So I don't gotta worry about click that much. Okay, I was about to exit out of that. Yep. No snap in hand. Path boy now. Think twice. Hmm. I think draw two is pretty good at the moment. Into another Esper Charm. Pretty good, pretty good. Colony does nothing unless we bounce this, tap that, down to eight. Give us a good card. It's pretty good. Let's try to draw two. It's pretty good. Path that. Giving them basic lands is not fun at all. Don't try that at home. Pathing soul spirit tokens does not feel good at all. Don't even try it. Only if you're in desperate need. Only if your life total is at eight on the dot. That's when you start pathing them boys or them girls or it is 2017 now so yeah they're females i would assume he has an instant in his hand it's pretty good secured the waist dang it if only we could do that should we slam that boy down now what if it's just removal let's go slam it down do it yolo oh my gosh it's removal it's removal we're coming at you five tokens coming at you we'll play that attack with all the boys or actually i don't be sexist either those, those female yeah i think those are female or it's 2017 so uh it's a one it's a gender that is not male or it's a difficult subject i'm sorry i try it, he doesn't have remand right dispel yeah no remand so think twice what's the worst he could do squall me uh Snap squall me. Bet. Let's go. Think twice. Please be two mana. Please be a snap. Oh, he got me. Yes. One of them swamps. Oof. Pretty good. Sounds pretty good too. Come at ya. Four of them boys then. Two turn clock. Sounds pretty good. Dispel for them spells. Spell snares for them snareable spells. Can't activate this colonnade. That boy's got... Wait, wait, wait. Let me fetch. Let me go match you up with seven in life total. Ooh. What is this lad that he's... 
Does this click? One, two, three, click. Out of all the cards he has, click. Whoa. It's worth it. Let me get the hollow fountain because it's... I was going to say white, but then I'm already on a controversial issue. But usually the white mana is, is like for good luck, in my opinion. The black mana is for uh, if I want to get it down and I want to be dirty. That's what the black mana is for. It is one draw. Let's see, is it GG? Is it the GG? I think our opponent is typing. No, he is not. Is he gonna tendrils out of this game? Tendrils us out of the game. Is he gonna Gurmag Angler us? That boy? The lad himself? With four to get one of these boys? I guess I'll give him a... This boy? It's pretty good. Pretty good, pretty good, pretty good. I think I'll get him this murderous cut or a... Or a, a bad card that throws in. Tendrils, cut. Geist. Uh, give him a cut. Because cut seems pretty hard to play at the moment. I'm pretty sure he can play it though. He's gonna cut one of our warriors. Oof. Some pretty good art, bro. Aaron Miller is pretty good. Is there any other Aaron Millers out here? Aaron Miller. Ooh. Ooh, you got us. Ooh, you got us. Think twice. Boy! Oof, you got him. Think twice. Path boy. Okay. Well, Esper control versus Esper mid ranged, Esper tap out, Esper control. It's a pretty good game, and thanks for watching the video. I would say like, subscribe, and all that stuff, but. That's only if you guys want to. Like, I'm not going to force that upon y'all. So, hey.